The Microsoft Education Award Laureates. Center for Puppetry Arts. Kariki. Digital Study Hall. Aaron Deering. Go North Adventure Learning Series, University of Minnesota. Daniel Retoy. 3D for All. The Center for Puppetry Arts employs interactive video conferencing technology to bring creative, hands-on learning experiences into the classroom. Arts are a vital part of a complete education, and they are one of the most powerful tools for teaching difficult concepts to students with a variety of learning styles. But tight budgets, especially in inner city and rural school districts, mean that many students rarely experience arts-based instruction. The Center for Puppetry Arts uses two-way interactive video conferencing technology to connect students with real-time art workshops. They guide students through making and manipulating their own puppets and use the puppets to explore a range of topics from rainforest ecology to African culture. The hands-on programs have engaged 130,000 students and are especially valuable to those with autism, learning disabilities, and language barriers. Kariki uses internet technology so that educators can share and co-develop free, high-quality instructional materials. Educational resources, especially textbooks, are prohibitively expensive for many schools around the world, perpetuating an educational divide. Beyond cost, there's little opportunity and few tools to help educators develop ideas together. Kariki uses the internet and social networking technology to provide universal access to excellent teaching materials and curriculum free of charge to anyone, anywhere in the world. The materials are submitted by users and partners, including publishers and universities. Unlike other online education resources, Kariki provides unique tools for users to collaborate on the development of new resources. A comprehensive peer and expert review ensures that the free materials are also the very best available. Digital Study Hall uses digital video technology to extend the reach of skilled teachers into underprivileged classrooms in India and Bangladesh. In the slums and rural areas of India and Bangladesh, there is a severe shortage of qualified teachers. The few skilled educators reach only a small number of students in their own classrooms. Digital Study Hall is building a repository of digital videos to share lessons from the best local teachers. The DVDs of real classroom sessions in regional languages are loaned by mail to underprivileged schools. Students watch while interacting with their own teachers for questions and activities. The program maintains the in-person connection between students and teachers, gives students the opportunity to learn from their region's most talented educators, and also helps train local teachers. Aaron Deering's Go North Adventure Learning Series engages satellite communications and multimedia technology so students can learn about culture and climate change. Students around the world need to understand climate change and their own impact on the planet. These topics are best understood through real-world experiences, but few students see firsthand the dramatic effects of global climate change. Aaron Deering created free online Arctic expeditions. Satellite communication and interactive web connections take students from around the world on real-time virtual trips where they learn from scientists and indigenous people. 
Students also collaborate on research projects that teach cultural understanding and the science behind issues such as global warming, oil exploration, and deforestation. In the process, they realize how their own decisions impact the environment. Daniel Ratoy developed technology to provide teachers with interactive three-dimensional blackboards so that far more students can master math and science. Teachers face the daunting task of explaining complex three-dimensional concepts such as geometry and chemistry using only language and a two-dimensional blackboard. Because of this challenge, students often become discouraged before they realize their potential in math and sciences. Daniel Ratoy created a three-dimensional PC work environment called Leonardo. Sensors are placed on a computer monitor. The teacher and students wear 3D glasses. And using a stylus, the teacher manipulates images in three dimensions. The affordable, easy-to-use system can turn abstract problems from calculating volume to visualizing molecules into concrete lessons. As a result, students develop the ability to think in more complex ways. The Microsoft Education Award Laureates, innovators, building a world where education enables everyone to realize their full potential.